Mayday, mayday, this is not a drill. Guys, yesterday Roblox released something called AI generative scripts or something, right? Where we can use AI to help us script things within a game. And that's pretty cool if you know about scripting or anything to do with it. And today, uh, yesterday, maybe the day before, by the time you see this video, I don't know, Roblox has released AI generative materials. This is huge. I'm excited to check it out. Let's go. So guys, first things first, if you don't know or don't have these features, you need to go to File, Beta Features, and write down here, once I find it, Material Generator enables the AI Material Generator, which allows you to generate any PBR material you can imagine using text input. This is massive, genuinely massive, and it will make the dream game go from here to here. Like, a, oh my God, I'm excited, okay? I'm excited. So we're gonna save that, and right here, we have a material generator. Let's go ahead and put a few parts down. I'm sorry if uh, if I seem excited, guys. This is, this is genuinely big, because at the moment, if you want a PBR material, you have to go to all of these websites, PBR Haven, textures.com, any of these, download files, input each color map, everything like that. This seems like a huge, huge thing. So I'm gonna say, um, old Warren brick. I've never used this before. This is my first time ever, so I'm kind of learning with you guys, but let's go ahead and generate. Okay, so it's popped up with some white images. I'm guessing it takes just a little while to load these. There we go. So now they're loaded and we can just click on one. Let's say this. Look at that, guys. This, yo. So from up here, it looked uh, it looked kind of bad. I'm not gonna lie. I was like, oh, it doesn't look that good. But look at this. It does have a cool three-dimensional kind of thing. And then we can just save and apply variant. We can adjust our studs per tile, more or less. That's really cool. Let's exit out of this one. I'm not a huge fan of any of the ones that it generated, but the cool part about AI is I could probably click generate again and uh, it would have a whole different list. I like how it saves our previous. That's nice, but it's going to bring up four new images. You could spend all day just generating and generating and you will keep getting new images. Look at this. Studs per tile needs to go uh, probably to about here. Uh, and that's pretty cool. Now keep in mind, this is like the first day of its release. So this is only gonna get better. Let's go ahead and try old stone uh, wall with grass. Now, once again, guys, AI, the more specific you are with it, the better your results are gonna be. But this is, this is huge. This is literally huge, man. Look at this. We just got all of these. Let's go ahead and click that. Bro, instant. Oh, that's why it looked bad at first. It like it loads in like a like a base map and then the rest of them. This is sick, man. This is literally sick. Probably my one of my favorite features, bro, so far. Uh let's save and apply variant. Uh cobblestone, I guess. So now we have that variant, and I'm guessing we'll have to go into our material manager and go find it. Here's cobblestone. Uh there's that. That cobblestone? I gotta be honest, I don't know exactly uh, exactly where it is here. Is it in our material service? It's not. So we'll have to figure that part out still, but I'm probably just overlooking something because I'm too excited. This is really, really cool though. Let's do uh, rainbow, rainbow brick road. Cause why not? Oh, we did a roll, whoops. Rainbow brick road, there we go. It's gonna generate something a bit random at first. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Look at this though, guys. Oh my gosh, we have a, uh, we've generated quite a bit here. So if we just grab this, throw it on here, let it load. Look at that, guys, instantly. This is so cool, dude. This is actually so cool. Uh, Let's go with like something like this. Even that, man, let's let it load. Boom, you can see when it's like the base map and then it's just like, boom, there's like the everything else that goes on with it right that's so so cool oh it's probably here so i'm gonna change this to cobblestone and then i'm gonna click here did we not save it <laughs> maybe we didn't save it man all right let's keep looking i want to try something like super weird uh let's do alien uh plant with green uh slime let's do purple alien plant all right guys purple alien plant with green slime this is Literally is, is your imagination.
imagination goes, man. You'll be able to do anything. And let's see if these look cool or if they're just okay. Look at this, man. Look at it. I don't like this one, but like this, bro, that's so sick, man. This is... Oh, I can't even say what, what I'm about to do with this because that's going to be crazy. I don't like organic. <laughs> Everyone's always like, oh, put organic on your bricks or put organic on this. No, it looks not great for a lot of things. Watch it load in. I think it just did. Bro, this is so cool, man. Now, I do want to mention this real quick. I know a lot of people are pretty torn when it comes to AI. A lot of people are like, hey, this is going to take all of our jobs away. Or, hey, this is going to ruin everything. Uh, I'm actually a fan of AI. Yes, a few years down the line, it probably will take all of our jobs and you know, the world as we know it will work differently, but for now, it will help us within our jobs, and uh, I would definitely take advantage of it. Let's try one super out of this world prompt just to see what we get. All right, guys, I typed in gold and black plant with white spikes and money. Uh, very, oh yeah, let's do in space. <laughs> in space, all right, obviously. Very specific prompt. Let's see what AI does with it, and the coolest part about this, guys if i say old brick texture right and you say old brick texture we're not gonna get the same stuff this will make a lot more games stick out be a lot more original everything i am very very excited look at this we have a black background with a gold plant we got money uh i mean it is what i asked for I can't lie. Definitely is what I asked for. We got this one where, uh, I mean, yeah, that's, that's cool. The white spikes, they've kind of interpreted as, uh, white dots or stars. Not mad at it. Definitely a weird prompt. This is clean, actually. <laughs> this, this, this one's pretty clean. I can't even lie, man. That's nice. All right, let's try one more thing. Let's go more on the real side. The more useful stuff. Let's see, uh, stylized grass with flowers. All right, stylized grass with flowers hours guys let's see what that pops up and let's turn this plane on its side so it acts as some ground there we go and now let's just throw one of these on it okay so if we did this without flowers i'm sure uh we would get a little bit better of a result here because of course it's printing onto a flat plane and uh yeah that's that's not exactly gonna work so let's go ahead do this stylized grass we're gonna grab this i mean if you go from the top you can tell but if you're down here and this is under the roblox grass i mean it, it might be kind of cool now of course there's plenty of other grass generations that uh <laughs> that we could probably get and definitely some better ones but this is a very 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 cool thing man i'm so excited we have ai generating scripts ai generating images or textures now what's next what is next man AI I generated 3D buildings. I mean, come on. But guys, I do think that is going to wrap it up for today. This is a very cool feature that I'm super excited about. Let me know what you think about it down in the comments below. But that's going to wrap it up. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a great day. Later.